Hi guys, it's Jibs here, your head boy. I pray you are all well. Hope you had a wonderful Christmas and New Year's. I hope you're all settling in well, working from home, joining on all of your online lessons, accessing SharePoint to complete work that the teachers are working very hard to set you. I can understand during these difficult, strange times, it can be tough for some and staying motivated can be really difficult. So it's important that we keep checking up on our friends and our loved ones. Make sure you stay hydrated and active during our virtual school days. And also do be looking out for house challenges and competitions to get involved in. For us year 11s, we finally have some clarification on our exams. Even though we're not doing them now, it's incredibly important that we keep working hard, completing work and assessments to the best of our abilities, as I'm sure we all want that top grade at the end of it. Remember guys, stay safe and hopefully we'll all get to see each other again soon once it's safe again. Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well and are getting used to this home learning circumstance yet again. So today I'm here with you to just share some useful tips and to kind of reinstate the importance of home learning and how it really will benefit you in the future, although it may not seem like it right now. So the sort of school morning routine for me would be getting out of bed, um, making the bed straight away so you're not tempted to get back in it, pulling on your blinds, getting dressed, going downstairs, greeting your family, saying good morning, perhaps play with your dog for five minutes, get some breakfast. That's really important for me because it really sets me off for a productive day and it means that I'm not feeling lazy, I'm feeling happy, I'm feeling ready to learn. And then heading back up to my workstation, which for me is the desk in my bedroom, I just find it's somewhere I can really focus, somewhere that I'm not gonna get many distractions. So a key thing you'll need is a device like a laptop or an iPad to access Teams and SharePoint, pen, pencil, ruler, pencil case, and maybe a study skills book to help revision. So hopefully by now you all know how to log on to Teams and SharePoint for the live lessons and to access work set by your subject teachers. Um, if not, please send me an email. I'll put it somewhere on here. Um, I'd be happy to answer any questions as well, I'm sure, any of your teachers. So if you feel better doing that, email them. Lastly, the most important thing is take breaks. And by this, I don't just mean I'm bored of listening to my teacher now, I'm gonna go on a walk or I'm bored, I'm going to go get something to eat. I mean, in between lessons where you should have break and lunch, make sure you're getting something to eat, something to drink, but also getting some fresh air. It's really nice to just go out, go somewhere local, walk your dog, take your brother or sister for a nice walk, um, and just get some fresh air. It would really, really, really make a difference to your day. I know it was short but that's all from me for today so like I said any questions or anything please feel free to send me an email or if not just have a great day carry on home learning you're all doing amazing.